Hey, this is Becky Taylor and I'm bringing you a bit of BS. I am thinking lots about active listening all the time. I think it is the power tool of communication skill because when it's done skillfully, the person that you are listening to feels heard. Uh, there's a real deep connection that you can have with a person. Now, good active listening doesn't mean you're agreeing or disagreeing with them. It just means you've actually heard what they've had to say, non-judgmentally. The skillful part of this, the thing that we build and we work toward is in kind of three pieces. And I think about focusing on the person's words. I think about, could I retell their story in my own words? And I think, could I ask them a great question about what they've just told me? When we can actively and reflectively listen like that, the person that's talking really feels validated in what their message is. And that of course enhances the dialogue between you and that other person. And that's why I consider it the power tool of communication. It is the one that requires the highest level of concentration on our part and the highest level of practice to become really, really good at it. In my veterinary background working with animals, I think that the reason that many people love their animals is when we talk to them and they give us that look like they can't wait to hear what we're gonna say next. That's what I imagine when I'm trying to do a good job of really actively listening. Somebody. I want to be so engaged with what they're saying and the way I judge whether or not I've been a good listener is those three criteria. Did I focus on their words? Could I retell their story in my own words? And could I ask them a great question? Thanks for watching. Stay nerdy.